I'm Grant. And I'm Connor. And today we're reporting from RWNS, Round Worm News Station. Our top story involves dirt. Now throw it off to you, Miles. Hello. This is Miles Hebrews reporting from RWNS. And today we are talking about dirt. Did you know that in every handful of dirt there are thousands of roundworms that can infect humans and even your pets? Hello, smiles again with some interesting facts about roundworms. Did you know that usually roundworms are microscopic, but sometimes they can get up to 20 inches long? Imagine that being in your stomach. Some roundworms lay eggs in your stomach, causing stomach aches. Imagine that. Also, roundworms can be anywhere in the world, like dirt, oceans, water. Thanks, Miles. Now, some more interesting facts about roundworms. Did you know that roundworms are able to produce around thousands of eggs every single day? And another fun fact is that roundworms evolved from flatworms millions of years ago and now can leave the ocean unlike flatworms. This is Grant and Connor, back from RWNS. Thanks for all those interesting facts about roundworms, Miles and Connor. Since we've been talking so much about how roundworms are so successful at breeding, do we know exactly how they do it? Can you answer that for us, Grant? Gladly, Connor. Well, to reproduce when you're a roundworm, you must first have a female who lays eggs in a patch of dirt. The male comes across and fertilizes over 200,000 eggs at a time. They can hatch within a few hours. This is called reproducing sexually. Thanks, Grant, for reporting in those harsh conditions. This just in, our scientists have witnessed bacteria being eaten by roundworms. They also discovered that roundworms eat fungus, blood, mucus, intestinal lining, and many other things. Did you know that roundworms have special hooks and suckers on the ends of their mouths that allow them to attach to the mucosa, which is the inner layer of your intestines, and they are able to suck out the blood from, from nutrient-rich veins? I'm back. Did you know that nematodes rely on their skin for respiration? Also, there are no specialized organs for gas exchange. However, waste leave through the gut and diffuse back across the body wall. Hey, it's Connor again. Did you know that the excretory system consists of excretory canals which unite from the mouth to the excretory pore? Also, excretion occurs through the cuticles. Nematodes don't have a circulatory system. However, they transfer oxygen and nutrients through diffusion. There are many roundworms. The eel worm is the first. They feast on wheat in farms and other such places. The next example is the guinea worm, which are parasites of animals and can infect them for long periods of time. Oscarius, the next worm, is an intestinal parasite and lines itself on the intestinal tract and gets food that way. Trichinella worms are human parasites. Fla Filarial worms spread from insects like mosquitoes into animals and infect them that way. With the nervous system of a roundworm, they have two major nerve cells. These are little lines that extend over the back with the dorsal nerve and over the belly with the ventral nerve. These two uh, nerve lengths um, have the muscles connect to them. All of the muscles will stretch out so that they can be told what to do from the nerve systems. However, with most animals, the nerves would a extend out from each other to touch each part of the muscle that needed to be told what to do. When it comes to roundworms, however, each of the muscles will grow out to the point where it can connect with the nerve and then extend along there. This is because the um, nerve systems are much smaller than they are 
on other animals and can only be extended so far. Eventually, both the dorsal, dorsal nerve and the ventral nerve reach a nerve ring at the head of the worm. And this is where all um, brain functions are carried out and sent through as electromagnetic pulses to each of the nerves. Hello, this is Miles Hubers reporting from RW. <laughs> Stop it! He's cracking up. It's gonna go away. It's gonna go away. Let's see, Connor. I think it makes me laugh. Who is this clown? Right. Here he goes. The random bus. <laughs> this is Grant and Connor, back to you from RWNS. <laughs>